today I thought I could do a shorter video. First of all, I'd like to thank the one person that has donated to my fundraising page and that person is very important to me and I'm so grateful that this person has donated even twice so far and so far this person is the only person that has donated some money for my IGCT. I think personally and I think in general it is absolutely important to remember that time is money when you have an illness that progresses just like MS and no time should be wasted. I need to get AJCD done ASAP. I need to get it done in a couple of months. This or the latest, the next early next year. And that's why I'm doing this fundraising in order to afford to pay my very expensive hospital stay, the treatment, the the whole set of 30 days I'm going to be spending in the hospital in Moscow. And this won't be possible for me without your support guys. So that's why it's ex extremely important that you support me financially. Go ha take the time to read through my fundraising page, watch my vlogs I've made so far on my channel, my YouTube channel and decide whether you want to give a small or bigger sum for the support I need from you guys. So I'm extremely grateful for all kind of support, especially a financial support I, I will get and I could get from you guys. So that's why just make the difference and make it possible for me to get better because I will get only worse if I cannot go through ADCT. And since time tends to fly, there are only maybe six months, at least less than a year until my treatment in Moscow. I don't have the accurate dates yet but since I'm on the waiting list and the waiting list is getting bigger and bigger and not everybody get the date they want and most of the people have problem raising funds so that's why they cannot go immediately even though they would get an early date for AJCT. But currently I'm on the waiting list and it's sure that I will be treated probably in the end of this year so that's why I really don't have that much time to reach my goal so that's why I have lowered my goal to 5,000 euros and the treatment costs approximately 45,000 in US dollars so in rubles that would be I don't know but anyways and since MS these can be very very difficult to detect from the very beginning that's why many people wait too long until they finally get to know about this whole procedure that is available for you we don't have the time to wait until FDA or other institutions approve this treatment as a valid uh, conventional MS treatment or treatment for other autoimmune disorders. So yes, we have to go and get and have AJCT done for ourselves the earliest it is possible. So if you have MS, just educate yourself, go, go online, find the, the right pages, find educate yourself about AJCT so that you are mentally and physically prepared to have it done 
find a center, find a facility that is able to provide it. Yes, I cannot stress it enough how important it is for people with MS to realize that the current symptoms, that their permanent symptoms are not going away. MS is far more intimidating and scary than any treatment like AJCT could ever be. Of course, AJCT has, it's a fact, has a, a relatively small uh, mortality rate, especially when you compare it to the mortality rate that most of surgical operations have. It's less, with AJCT, um, the mortality rate is is not close to 1%. There's probably nothing I fear more than I fear MS. Luckily, there is this opportunity, there is the possibility that the MS will be seized, the progression will be seized, and I will even get a lower EDC score when my old symptoms could be par at least partially reversed. And that warms my heart, that is a life-saving saving treatment. I have to admit that once I was uh, diagnosed a couple of years back, I was that naive patient that had just had overcome a set of relapses with some recovery. And then at that time I thought that, okay, Maybe MS will stop now. I'm taking, I'm doing my injections right. I'm eating right. I'm exercising right, and I do. I'm being active, and I'm just coping, and I'm accepting things as they are. And there's no more I can do. <laughs> that was very naive to think that I was. There was another truth. MS would progress. MS would progress despite all my efforts and all my positive thinking. MS did progress and MS will keep progressing unless I will have this intervention called AJCT. So one thing that you should trust at least is definitely the MS. MS is capable of anything. When you have bad luck, MS can mess with your brain, it can mess with your everything, your every ability to function and talk and speak and walk and do anything can be destructed and damaged by MS. Some of, some of you might still think that I can wait another year that MS will be kind and gentle and I don't think I would be any different next year from the way I'm now, but you can never know, you can never tell. The only thing you should do and you can do is to do it now in order not to have these thoughts and not to, not to make guesses and assumptions about the future because MS can progress quickly, MS can progress slowly but one thing is sure that MS will keep progression even when you have mild symptoms like I sometimes tend to have sometimes I feel that I have very um, very very aggressive and severe symptoms but For me, my symptoms are severe enough to have AJCT done. And honestly, I can tell you that AJCT is a blessing. I don't have any doubts, any fears concerning the upcoming treatment. I just beg and pray in my head that the day would come either faster because currently my life has ceased. I have I had stopped living for conventional 
MS drugs I'm, I'm currently treated with, I will probably develop new symptoms. I will probably have worsening of these horrible symptoms I have now that prevent me from working. I'm not going to take a chance that I would go to get AGCT. And that's why I am really, really waiting for the day to come to start with the procedure and have a procedure that would probably change my life and probably bring me back closer to the healthy human, to the healthy. Not a single day passes that I wouldn't be thinking about my life now and the life I could have without MS and it makes me so sad because this treatment is not offered close to me it's not offered I have to wait several I have to wait I have waited years to get this done and in the meantime, the very minor minority of people battling with MS are aware of AJCT as an option treatment option that's why we need to spread AGCT awareness because we are after all most of the patients are people in their 20s their 30s their 40s their 50s they're young people battling with MS so what kind of societies what kind of communities are we building with only disabled people is that what is going to save humankind I don't think so so we need to find cure for every, from every aspect, we need to find a cure that will have the greatest results, which only you know you best, only you know your health best, only you, yourself, and what's inside of you is something that you know best. You are the best advocate for your health and never know what the future brings but at least you can make a difference. You can make the difference by... Uh, this video turned out to be longer than I expected. But I hope I was convincing and I hope that you gained some more knowledge or uh, got to know me a bit better and this blog. I hope you will visit my fundraising page on GoFundMe and hopefully you will also choose to support me financially by donating. So I thank you very much and see you next time.